Hey foodies, it's Sam here with the Cedar Point Food Blog. This week I wanted to talk about another new restaurant that's opened up at Cedar Point. This one is called Miss Keith's House. Okay, now this restaurant is for all my Chipotle lovers out there. It is set up similar to Chipotle from what they offer to how the assembly line of food is set up. Where you're going to find your difference though is going to be in the taste. Miss Keith's offers rice bowls, salads, or nachos. For meats you can get chicken or carne asada. Then you can get black beans, pinto beans, or fajitas. For veggies, you can get hot or mild salsa, corn, lettuce, and jalapenos. Then to top it off, you can add sour cream and cheese. For an extra charge, you can add guacamole or queso. Now we didn't do that, but it is an option. So on our bowls, we got rice at the bottom, then carne asada for the meats, pinto and black beans, fajitas, and then for veggies, we did add mild salsa, corn, lettuce, jalapenos, and then topped with sour cream and cheese. The meal also does come with chips and salsa. Now, the carne asada was super tender and seasoned very well. Definitely would get it again. The jalapenos were not too spicy, but did add a hint of a heat to them. The flavor overall differed from what you would get from Chipotle and tasted more like something you would get from a Mexican restaurant. Not so much of that lime and cilantro flavor, but more of that herb and tomato sauce flavoring. The meal was extremely filling, and it was really delicious. We will definitely be going back, and I think it was a great addition to Cedar Point. I just wanted to add that we did notice the Boardwalk Cruisers are back. Toss Ice Cream is back open, and some of the shows were open, including Miss Lil's. And all of the rides did seem to be up and going at this point. Now the barnyard was also open and they had the animals out for everyone to see. Adventure Island was not open, but we did see on the map that it looks like June 10th it will be back open. That's it for this week. Next week we will be back with tips and tricks on doing Cedar Point with newborns and babies. So make sure you stay tuned in because I know there are a lot of questions on this out there. So don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll see you back next week. Bye!